Okay, so the question is asking us, what is the concentration of NaOH in a solution containing 14 grams of NaOH, which is sodium hydroxide, in a 50 milliliter solution? Okay, so when we're calculating concentration, we're calculating the number of moles per liter. Another word for this is molarity. But you'll notice that we have grams here. So to be able to calculate our concentration, the first thing that we need to do is calculate how many moles we have, and then divide that by our volume of 50 mils, and that'll give us our molarity. So we're gonna start by calculating the molar mass of our sodium hydroxide. So let's go to the periodic table and look at our elements. From here, we can look at our atomic mass and calculate our molar mass. So we have one atom of sodium, one of oxygen, and one of hydrogen. So if we total their atomic masses, we get 40 grams for one mole of sodium hydroxide. Okay, so now let's convert our 14 grams to moles using this information. So if we multiply our 14 grams by our conversion fraction here, moles on the top, grams on the bottom, so that our grams will cancel out, giving our final answer in moles, we would get 14 times one divided by 40, giving us 0 0.35 moles. Great. So now we need to look at our volume and it's 50 milliliters. So be careful here, it has to be in liters. So to calculate our molarity, we're first gonna convert our 50 milliliters to liters using this conversion factor. One liter is a thousand milliliters. Again, writing it so that our units would cross out so our final units would be the answer that we want, which is in liters. So 50 times one, of course, is 50 divided by a thousand gives us 0 0.05 liters. Okay, so now we can go back and finish off our calculation here for molarity, which remember is moles per, which means divided by our liters. So we have 0 0.35 moles divided by 0 0.05 liters, giving us seven as our final answer, that is the molarity for this particular solution.